Hey everyone, it's Tim. I am back in town and I wanted to thank you for the comments on my last video. Um, I went to Arizona last weekend because my aunt was in hospice with cancer and she did pass away Sunday morning. So I spent a few days with family. It's now Thursday. I'm back in Portland. Um, kind of trying to get back into the swing of things and I felt like going to Goodwill today. I think my aunt would have, she liked thrifting I believe and uh, this trip is for her. So I'm gonna go to two different Goodwills today and see what I can come up with. Well you either go in and see nothing that you like or you want everything. And today I wanted everything. Hey there, I am home and I picked up quite a bit of stuff while I was out at Goodwill today. I'm just going to kind of go through and pull things out in no particular order and show you what I got. Um, for this entire box, I'm pretty sure not one item was half off. It was the blue tag half off sale this week and I'm pretty sure nothing was blue. So, whoops. <laughs> but. I'll just dive right in and hopefully I don't run out of storage on my phone. So first I picked up a phone case. Uh, I need to kind of clean it off from where the label was. But it is a, uh, let's see here, a Versus, a Varus, no it's a Varus. Um, I did a quick Google search. It's got one of these, um, you know, put the cards in the back, what's it called? A, a card storage case. Um, I, I A quick search online showed me that these were like $39 retail, so I got it for $3. I'll kind of, you know, rub off that residue from the sticker, but otherwise I needed a new phone case anyway. Let's see here. I picked up two Ikea vases. Honestly, this one I probably didn't need. Um, one of them was $7.99 and the other one was $6.99 and these are only like seven and ten dollars at the store so you know I like them and I've, I've always kind of liked this look I wanted to go with white because I a lot of my decor is very dark and neutral and so I wanted something kind of bright and light to go into the spring and summer and so that's why they caught my eye but I thought I was getting a better deal on them and then when I looked online and saw that they were normally only a few dollars more, I, I feel like I probably didn't need to get them. I could have waited and got them cheaper, you know. Oh well. A cheeseburger. That was not from Goodwill. I picked up Les Mis, the non-musical DVD. I had seen it once a long time ago, but I kind of figured that'd be a good classic to pick up and have in my collection. I grabbed two LED light bulbs. I don't really know anything about these. I don't even know if they're the right size, or the right watt. I don't know what 9 versus 6 watt is, but I figured I would try them out in some of the lamps I have and kind of see um, what is up. I will try... I might return them if I don't like them or if, you know, for any number of reasons, but I figured it would be worth a try, so I picked those up. I got a Target Threshold brand soap dish. So I, on a rare occasion, have a bar of soap and I thought this would be a cute way to store it. I've been kind of keeping an eye out for a soap dish for a while and to have one that was never used was a plus. And then I got this tub. It was only $3.00. I imagine there was probably a lid that I didn't pick up that was right next to it, but I've decided I don't really want it. I, I, yeah, I got it thinking I would use it to like treat clothes, you know, like fill it with water and baking soda and I could rub them down because I don't really have a, you know, a, and then I can leave it and have it sit overnight or whatever, but I don't know. I think I need to get a bigger one, so I'm not, I'm going to return that and get credit. So I'm going to put that in my return pile. Okay, um, I picked this up, a candle holder. Orange is kind of the accent color in my living room, so 
this kind of popped out at me. It is a Pottery Barn. And it was only four. Oh, that was blue. So I did get something for blue. And so it was normally $5. This would have been $2.50 since it was half off. That's cool. Yay. <laughs> so I'll put that in the living room and put candles on it or whatnot. I picked up some really cute shorts for my niece. Her birthday is in less than a month. It's a few weeks away on May 15th. So she'll be three. And I have a few things already that I've kind of been stocking up to give her, but now I've got some fun summer shorts too. To go with these, I wasn't quite sure between two shirts. They're both this kind of tie-dye look. So there's this one and this one. She has a darker complexion, so I think this will look really nice, but I feel like she looks good in orange too. So I got them both because I just couldn't choose and they'll go with these shorts. So, they were each $3, so $9 for an outfit and a half, not too bad. I also got her this set. It's a Hello Kitty pajamas. These were, I don't know where the tag is, but they were cheap too. And uh, these ones had the tag on, so they'd never been worn before. It was $4 for this. And this is for size four, and she's only turning three, but she is big for her size, so I imagine I'm gonna save these and probably make it part of her Christmas gift. So if my sister is watching, maybe she'll forget before Christmas. I got a few picture frames as well. Um, this one I thought was so adorable. It's a red door, and then you open the door, and it's just like pictures can be like flipped through. I thought that was so cute. Um, it was only $5. Maybe I'll, you know, honestly, I could even use this for my $5 Goodwill challenge for summer, maybe. So you might see this again. We'll see. And then I got two other frames for to use as gifts. This one, I think, you know when something is so ugly that it's kind of endearing? Um, that's what this was. So it's like a, a white picket fence. And it's two pictures. Um, it's not really ugly, it's kind of cute. It's not really my style at all, so I figured this would be kind of a fun gag gift to give someone. So, um, yeah, just a little simple frame. It was only $3. And then this one, also to get as a gift, I thought this was really pretty. Just two picture frames there. And uh, let's see, this one was $5. So I'll kind of, you know, dust it off and I'm going to save this. I don't really have anyone in mind to give it to yet, but um, I think it's really pretty. And if I get good pictures of us, me and whoever it is, this could be a nice gift. So I'll hold on to that. This little guy, <laughs> he's just darling. Um, it was $4. And I'm, I got this for a coworker of mine. She is a big thrifter. We always kind of share our Goodwill finds. And so I'm just gonna put this on our desk tomorrow. And um, <laughs> I don't know, I think he's kind of cute. He's kind of hideous actually. But I like his little ukulele, his big feet. So that's for Tanya. And then I got a bowl. You can't really tell, but like, this is as deep as it goes. So the bottom is just kind of that see-through, it's a very thick bottom. Um, this was $7, but I love it. I like the shape, I like that it's glass, and I'm just gonna put it on my counter and kind of use it as a catch-all for things like, if I have lemons or if I have bread or something I took out to remind myself to take to work the next day, I just leave it all on my counter and then the counter gets really cluttered. So this will be a nice addition to the counter to kind of wrangle everything. And let's see, the last, well, let's see, I got four of these plates. They're the little mini ones. They were each a dollar because I have these bigger ones. They're Ikea plates, so I got these mini ones to go. Um, and I'm probably going to get rid of this entire middle row because these are big plates that I don't really use and then little mini ones that I only use seldom. So now I have these ones which are slightly bigger, which I can use in place of these. 
So I got four of these. They were each a dollar. And then I picked up three shirts for me that were kind of bright and fun for the spring and summer. I'm, I took some pictures in the dressing room, so I'll insert those. They might be upside down or sideways or something, but I'll insert them. Here's one of them. It is a Hollister shirt, which is not really a brand I ever wear, but I liked the shirt itself. And then I got this one, which is Banana Republic, I believe. Yeah, Banana Republic. And then I got this one, which I don't really know the brand. It's Cultura. I'm not really familiar with it, but it's just a short sleeved. I like the stitching. Anyway. Anyway. So, that is what I got. I feel like, considering how much money I spent, I probably could have gotten a little bit more. But, that one $3 bin's going back, so there you go. Um, that'll do it for the haul, and I'll see you next time. And here are those pictures I took in the dressing room. I have a quick before shot and then the three shirts that I ended up picking up. There was a fourth shirt that I didn't really like and I didn't even take a picture.